of collecting and measuring the volume of gas is using a gas syringe. Gas syringe is made of glass and the plunger can move very smoothly in the barrel. Any increase in gas pressure inside the barrel will push the plunger outwards. One thing that you need to be very careful of when using gas syringe is um, the you, you have to pay attention to the final volume of the gas produced because if uh, in in this case we are using 50 ml capacity of gas syringe um, other gas syringes might be smaller than this so the reaction that you're going to do must not produce gas exceeding 50 ml Otherwise, this plunger will be pushed out too fast and then it will just um, shoot out and break. The gas syringe must be placed in a horizontal position. This way, the plunger will not be affected too much by the gravity. To demonstrate how to use the gas syringe to collect and measure the volume of gases, I'm going to use another uh, portion of dilute hydrochloric acid and this time using calcium carbonate. First check that the plunger is pushed all the way into the barrel. That way there is no gases uh, collected in the gas syringe at the moment. Then, after you drop the calcium carbonate, stopper the conical straight away. So remember the position of the gas syringe should be horizontal like this, so that the plunger is not affected by um, the pull of gravity. As bubbles are produced in this reaction, you can see now that the plunger has been pushed a little bit upward. Thank you.